Uh, so before this, uh, the only thing I knew about cybernetics is, you know, I, I'm an old guy, so it was always about merging machines with, with people physically. And this is really more about exploring the concepts of uh, human-computer interaction. I work in technology and I've come to see what the students are doing with their creativity. I think innovation is such an important capability. It helps the economy thrive and it puts us on the, the global stage. Our prototype is called AI is for Auslan. So Auslan is the Australian sign language. And what we really wanted to do was to create a cyber physical system in which we'd use technology to bring awareness to the community of non-deaf hard of hearing people to become more aware of Australian sign language. And the way that we did that was to use technology to teach non-deaf hard of hearing people how to sign A, B, C, as an initial immersion to Auslan. Our prototype, titled the Haptic Compass, is effectively a wristband with four vibrating motors embedded in it. The intention is for those buzzers to provide navigational guidance to the wearer. The Alistat is a, an educational tool that um, allows us to observe behaviour in a dynamic, complex environment. It's useful for an educational context, so talking to students or children about technology or a more advanced audience about complexity and, and structures. Thinking about coming along to an open day like this, you've really got to keep your, your mind open. The most important thing you can do with technology is really understand the art of the possible. So whatever's been built for a particular purpose, it's not constrained by that purpose and it's up to your imagination to decide how you can apply that technology in new and unique ways.